All right, everyone, welcome back to Fright Night. Oh, I've got to replay my loan to finish this objective. So, last episode, I've, this was the newest ride that I built, but I just realised that path isn't connected to anything because it's a stupid bloody game. So I'm going to have to rethink this pathing slightly. Um, yeah, so the idea is to save up for a big roller coaster to go in the middle here. And by doing that, to do that, I'm going to have to um, sort of build a lot of other rides, I think. Probably probably be a good idea. So this is going to bring in a bit of money, though. I'll just re rethink this, because this is not going to work. There we go. So if I do that with the other side, should be fine and dandy, shouldn't it? So I've got to think of some kind of theming for this ride, but I've only got $92, so... Let's see who comes along to ride on this. And up here I'm going to need some shops and things. I quite like this ruin sort of um, theme they've got going on up here. I might I might put that on the, the Lucifer's Revenge uh, ride. Yeah, so we need another sort of eating area like this, but over the other side. Taking another ride on the uh, Freudstein's house. Just, just to kill some time. Maybe we'll go ride the uh, winged rat. Oh, look at Frankenstein's. Revolting. Hope no one puts me in that Iron Maiden. Okay, do you want to see the winged rat in action? Winged rat. It's weird. Ah, oh, I see, look, they lay down. So really upside down like that, looking up. Okay. Enjoying yourself, everyone? Hmm. Look at the distance. Look at the... Where the hell are we? It looks like fucking... Um... That place out of Xenobl Xenoblade Chronicles X, the planet you land on. Whee! A double loop! Over the roof of the building. Into a... I don't know what that is, a pretzel or something. I don't know technical names for these types of loops. Corkscrew right at the end of a massive drop, that's got to be quite intense. I don't think it's very realistic this ride, but oh well. Oh shit! Ah, go no! Ah! Pretty exciting. Yeah, I think I'll try and pay off the loan. It's only five grand, and then we might get a boost. And he's going to just buy it right back again if uh, if we need it, which we probably will for this roller coaster. Okay, we should be hitting our last grand to pay off in a second. Oh, come on! Can we make it to the Coon level? Extra land is now available to purchase. I don't think we'll need to buy any extra lands, to be honest with you. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we'll need to buy a, all this land. We can easily do the objective just in this area here. So let's instantly take that loan back out again. I'm gonna add a bit of theme into these rides because it annoys me when they don't have any theme in whatsoever on them. that work? Oh my god, that was... oh. Well, kind of worked. That'll do me. 
That's that's good enough. I created a thing and did a thing there successfully, sort of. That's that's all right though, isn't it? Look, we've got a castle around there, so people go in there for their dinner. Yum yums. We need more rides. What's this? I like this ride. It's kind of weird. It's just where do we put it? There's no room for it. Maybe there. Yeah, look at that. It's got like a weird crow's head. There we go. There's that ride. I don't know what to call it. Not Topple Tower. The Raven's Cry. I know what to call it. This is a good name for a ride like that, isn't it? Uh, wait. Let's call it... Nevermore. Pretend like I know anything about Edgar Allan Poe. Uh, let's try it. Test it out. We'll see. See how it looks. It's going to be spooky. Right, just gulp. Uh, I think they. Go. Oh yeah, they like get swung about. It's kind of scary, isn't it? Maybe I should put some bushes around to make it look like a spooky hedgerow. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, kind of like uh don't know why I'm so obsessed with theming this bloody house. No, no one even goes on this stupid ride. No one even likes this ride. I want to get some theming on this as well. Oh, I had an idea. Just another sort of castle type of thing. Because this, this area up here has got a bit of a castle feel to it. There's these sort of bits and... I'll put them shops in the castle, so walls. We'll go back to the castle walls and we'll put something in. We could have some bits on this wall where it looks like it's kind of collapsed in a bit. Yeah. Do 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 Mm, it's turned out to be a bit of a complicated build again. What the f Why do I do this? Why do I start these things? What the fuck? Hey, I made it to be a true tycoon somehow. How did that happen? Maybe <laughs> maybe I've, I've increased the excitement of this ride so much since adding these, this scenery. Uh, well, you know what? I'm still going to build my, fr my uh, Dracula ride. It doesn't matter if I've finished the thing. Have I, have I increased the excitement of this ride so much? Let's have a look. I haven't even finished the scenery yet. Let's have a look at the... Yeah, I've bumped it up to a 7. Just by adding the scenery to it. Well, that goes to show how good it is to add scenery to your rides. I'll carry on with this anyway. I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying this build here. Alright, there we go. We've got a castle. A magnificent castle. For Lucifer's Revenge. Whoa! Ah! Wee! Cool. All right, that looks nice. I like that. I like that, what I've just built. Wasted my money again now, that's the only thing. <laughs> Don't get obsessed with it. Don't get obsessed. It's just a stupid ride in a computer game. There's no need to get obsessed. It's kind of a bit buried in the mountain. Because it's old, you see. Hmm. Park's starting to look a bit more solid now. You know, there's... A lot of bits to kind of look at as you go around. There's something for everyone. There's plenty of places to eat, there's information stands. Freudstein's house is still attracting nobody. Wait, I know, let's just let's just turn the price right down to two two dollars to ride Freudstein's house. Come on. Come on, you can't say no to that. This whole area here is just kind of there's nothing here. I put a a drink stall there, but Jack O'Lantern, what are you doing up here? 
this this isn't a good place to hang about. You're shirking on your responsibilities of entertaining people by hiding where you know there's going to be no one walking. Perhaps we could put a haunted hotel in, inside this. That's always a possibility, isn't it? Yeah, Jackie. Yeah, Jackie. Okay, so I built... I don't know what I've built in there, to be honest. It, um, I just built it as much as I could. Like a little tiny ride inside there. Somewhere inside this structure. It just goes around in a tiny loop with a tunnel. It's, it's nothing special. I just... I felt like there needed to be something here because there's, there's just nothing here for anyone. Let's have a look at what, what we've created. Wow. <laughs> totally worth the money. Yeah, one, one dollar to ride that ride. The Terror Tunnel. There we go. That is going to be attracting visitors by the millions. Have you heard about the new ride, the Terror Tunnel? Yeah, I've heard about that. I heard it's going to be... One of the scariest rides ever created. Yes, it is. You've heard correctly. It really is. Two people on ride. Here goes nothing. Yeah, that's that's literally true. That it's nothing to that ride. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? Are you ready? There's a terror tunnel. Ah! Put your arms up in the air. Oh, she's feeling sick from it. <laughs> so little girl, what did you think of the ride? I want to go on Terra Tunnel again. So I'm going to fast forward time for a bit. I want to collect a little bit of money. And I'm going to finish off this roller coaster that I've had an idea for for the whole time. Okay, so nearly got 10 grand. That's probably when I'm going to start building the new roller coaster. I know which kind of coaster I want to build. It's the, there we go, inverted wild mouse. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do here, but I've got a kind of idea. No, it doesn't quite work. My, my idea was to have like a really slow turn upside down, so that they're kind of hanging upside down. Let's try something else then. What I wanted to do, right? I'll come clean right now what I'm going to do. These fire pits here. I wanted to have the wild mouse going across these fire pits. So the people are hung upside down above the fire pits of death. Right, if we put a break here. Let's see what happens now. Slowly, slowly upside down. Slowly. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why that amuses me, but it does. Okay, so there's the basic design. Starts off slow, goes around, does it this little hanging gimmick. And then it goes into a series of terrible vertical drops that no one would ever want to ride on. So, let's start the theming on this then. What I'm probably going to do is encase the ride in some kind of like, you know, put something around the outside of the track so that it's mainly indoors. So it's going to be a castle themed ride again. So this might look a bit weird for the moment, but this is going to be the this is going to be the coaster. Trust me, elaborate, elaborate. I live in Newton Aycliff. I live in Newton Aycliff. There goes some theming, theming of the rides. There goes some theming, theming of the rides. There goes some theming. Do 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 do! Look at the fucking size of this castle I'm building. Okay, here's a bit. This bit here is a bit fucked up because um, this hill it's it's hard to select the edge or the inner. I had to just take whatever I was given. Seems though this is the last ride I'm going to build. I don't really care that much. I'm just trying to make it look nice. Nearly finished. Nearly finished. Just need to put a few more. There we go. That's all right, isn't it? That'll do. 
That'll do, won't it? What year are we on? Year 10. It's taken me like six years to build this roller coaster. I wish someone would end my life. Okay, so what do we have for the colour of the truck? Maybe I should make the truck look like it's made of wood or something. It's so clear. The game is so clear and lovely. I love playing this game. Oh, what does that look like? Yeah, I like that brown track. It looks like it looks kind of medieval. Um, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it after a film that I've got on DVD. Doctor Tars. Torture. Dungeon. So here we are. Very claustrophobic ride. Whoa! Over the hot coals. And then we're up. Shit! Whoa! Okay, and we're out into the courtyard. Whoa! Holy fuck. Here we go, guys. Ah! Oh. Ah! Whoop. Ah! And so on. Oh, that's a sharp turn. That's our next snap of that one. I'm back into the house. Back into the home. Oh, that's alright, isn't it? That's not too bad. I think this courtyard looks a bit bare, but I don't know what to put in there. Yeah, I'll put some things like that in there. That's where Dr. Tar tortures his victims. The rating for this is 8. <laughs> Intensity is 9. Nausea rating 5, which is fine by me. Come on, don't be shy. Everyone's shit scared. Oh, here we go. Here's a plucky adventurer. Our first rider. So he's the first person to ride Dr. Tar's Torture Dungeon. Dr. Tar's Torture Dungeon is really good value. What? That's $7 to ride that thing. I enjoyed Dr. Tar's Torture Dungeon. Although I did shit my trousers. This is one of those pukomatic rides. I goes pukomatic. Igor lives in Dr. Tar's Torture Dungeon and has built himself a pukomatic thing. Yeah, I'd call that done. There we go. We've got a nice, complete park there. There's our spooky uh, Freudstein's house. The folly, the biggest folly I built for this park. Freudstein's house. Um, and then we've got this massive castle in the middle. This is the centerpiece now. This ridiculous roller coaster that I built. And we've got some nice demonic sort of thing over here. And um this. You know, it's all it all comes together nicely. Of course the best ride in the entire park is uh this one over here. This is the this is the crowning glory of the entire park, I'd say. <laughs> hey! Are you ready for fun? Get ready for this. Get ready. Get ready. Hold on tight. Oh, fuck. So, hope you enjoyed. This has been uh, Fright Night, I think the park's called. Um, if, you, if you enjoyed, give it a like. Subscribe if you're not already. And um, I'll get on with another level soon enough. All right. Bye-bye.